Welcome back to Misfits Curse Kitchen. Today we're going to be cooking up some peeling chocolates. I've been saving these film and scraps for a hot second and it was finally the day to melt them down. I sorted them into two different color schemes and popped them in the oven and goddamn, was it taking forever, but that's when I realized that we accidentally had it set to freedom units and not Celsius. Finally, it started melting down, but I would have to keep refilling the containers with more filament. From there, I would slam it on the countertop to get the air bubbles to come to the top, but pro tip, don't try and pop them. At long last, they were finally full, actually a little too full, but I put them in the fridge so that they could cool off. This is how much filament we had left and finally, they were ready to come out. Because I overfilled them, I soldered off and sanded down the bottoms of them, and if you too want to make shot glasses, it takes about 44 grams of filament. Later that day, things got a little out of hand when I decided I was going to try and wrap these in epoxy, and while my motto in life is typically safety last, the people of the internet told me if I didn't use this respirator, I would highly regret it. 24 hours later it was done, but unfortunately the thing I didn't take into account was that PLA, I guess, floats in epoxy? Oops. Sadly, the black one's kind of a lost cause, but I love the rainbow one. Finally, it was time to test them out, and you know what they say, it's 5 o'clock somewhere. Cheers, friends.